How's it going, everyone? I have Sylvan 120 here. Right next to me are three little Sonic mystery boxes. For those who may or may not know, I attended the Rhode Island Comic Con uh, this past weekend uh, with my uh, friend Joan and another friend of his. And this was the first ever Comic Con I have actually ever attended. Yeah, 20 years later, I know. Yeah. But, um,. For the first one ever going to, it was definitely worth it, and I really had a lot of fun. I got to uh, meet a bunch of celebrities, and I got a crap ton of stuff. So, um, right next to me, I have this big uh, Sonic Mystery Box, as well as two little mini ones here. These have just been uh, sitting in my room for the uh, past three days now. I still have not opened these, so I, I literally don't even know... Uh, what's inside because I wanted to save it for uh, this uh, very video here So um, I guess we'll start off with these with uh, this little one here uh, It's a vinyl minifigure Okay, it uh, includes a collector base So um, it seems that there are multiple different types that could be inside So you got all these possible figures on one side and then a bunch of badniks on the other side. So we shall see what lies in this first one. And the glue and tape the box shut. Oh, lovely. Trash there. That's kind of sealed. Just like feeling it, doesn't sound, doesn't feel like it could be a bad neck. Okay, that was really weird. My camera just uh, stopped recording all of a sudden. So uh, the first one, what we have is this little guy. Uh, it turns out he is uh, some sort of bad neck. It looks like, and um, looks like this is the. Uh, thing that stands on. It's just a ring with a plastic insert. That's pretty cool. So we've got one down. Stand him down right there. There's nothing else in here, is there? Alright. Now on to the next one. trash box here. Now let's hope that this won't be the same figure. Otherwise that's eight bucks I'm never gonna get back. Oh nope, it's not, okay. It's Classic Sonic himself! Ain't that just cute? Still a little casual Generations pose right there. Comes with the uh, same uh, base holder. Oh, wow. So I just noticed that the uh, holder has a little dimple right here. And right on Sonic's foot is this little... Uh, peg. So it looks like you just snap it on there. Just like that. Must be one for this one too. Oh, yep. I can't believe I didn't see that. Huh. There we go. Let's hope we can go fully in. Oh, no, it's all the way in. That peg is uh, a little bit longer than the other one, so it kind of Juts out a little bit, but um, all right. Now on to the big one. I had to carry this for like all all day, so the uh, handle broke off. But I, like I said, I still have not opened this officially until right now, as we speak. 
and it's got all your typical Prince of Sonic there. Oh, there's a few things in here. Starting off with a mug with an outline of tails, black and white. That's pretty cool. Nice. I wonder why it's all uh, outlined like that. Except there's no you don't see every day. Probably gonna drink out of that all the time now. Oh, we got a wallet. Typical uh, bifold wallet. Ironically, I'm probably gonna have no uh, need for this because I already have a chain leather wallet and I've been using that one for over the past two years now. Silica Joe, don't need that. So, got that. Got that on the inside. Thing for your ID. All your money. But it doesn't seem there is a uh, little change pocket, which I do not like. I'll definitely hold on to this though, since that was all part of the package. What else we got here? Seatbelt buckle keychain. Hmm. Oh, that's pretty cool. So it looks like. Oh, it doesn't come out all the way. Or does it? Oh, it does. I'll just undo this here real quick. Push sides to release keys. Push sides to release keys. Hmm. So it looks like I just got a little thingy here, just buttons right there. And it's got a tiny little picture of Sonic Tails there. This is old school, right on it. That's really neat. It's made of, completely made of plastic. It looks like just snaps right in. You just press these down to uh, loosen it up. And you got that there. And it looks like you just stick your keys right on there. You just do it like that. Pretty cool. I already have all my keys on something else already, so probably something I'm not going to use. But I'll still hold on to it though. And so we got two more things. Looks like we got a uh, another buckle down product. Looks like a little bracelet. Yeah, it's just a uh, little uh, bracelet, a stretchy one, of uh, about a um, sewn-in thing of Sonic, 8-bit Sonic right there, and all around it's just rings and him posing. Yeah. That's pretty cool. And last but not least, a lanyard. Huh. I'm honestly surprised. I actually thought there was going to be some like mystery action figure in here, but it, no, it's just a bunch of uh, miscellaneous uh, stuff, which is uh, excuse me, which is uh, really surprising because I mean this is technically the first ever. Um, mystery box I've actually ever gotten at an event like this and um, they had a bunch of these there I was tempted to grab a second one because I thought that they were originally uh, mystery figures but no it's just basically any stuff so I'm kind of glad I only got one otherwise I would have only had double of all the stuff that I have of that I have here plus that's like 60 bucks I probably wouldn't get back um, yeah. 
So yeah, it's just the same um, layout as on my bracelet here. Rings, uh, and Sonic just making moves. And it's stretchy like the other one too. But something that I've never really liked about lanyards is that why do they always have to make it so that it's not symmetrical? Or even. So it's like you take, so it's like you want to fold this here but then coming, but then come down, it, it, it's like off, you know? Or if you want to do it, it, like you can't have it completely flattened without some odd form crinkle kind of thing happen. I, I don't know why they're made like that, honestly. It's got the hook. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Excuse me, I must be pretty tired. Well, yeah, there's uh, nothing else in there, but that's uh, all that there is. So, um, yeah, it's pretty cool. We got the uh, mug, got an action figure of Sonic himself, and the mini one, some little coconut monkey badnik from the other box. This, this creature does look familiar, though. I don't fully remember that. Which game he's from though? Keychain, lanyard, a bracelet, and a wallet. So uh, yeah, that was definitely a uh, interesting first experience. Uh, hope you guys liked it. Thanks for watching.